Hey everybody, what's going on? My name is Aaron from Quick Attack Films, and today we're playing a new game called Darkest Dungeon. Now, if you don't know what it is, it's basically a, a turn-based RPG, um, but with the roguelike mechanics, I think. I mean, I haven't really gotten very far. I mean, my freaking dungeon's named Darkest Bungeon. And then just a period, then the word ha, like it's funny. Anyway, let's start a new dungeon. Let's exit. Let's get rid of that one. Um, let's start a new dungeon. Darkest. Um, d the darkest. No, we're not even gonna. Oh, I have. Oh, okay, it doesn't have to be darkest. Okay, I'm gonna call it. Okay, Gringle McSnickleberries. And um, let's just jump right in. Let's see what happens. Well, I actually know what happens. A cutscene happens. Spoiler alert. I shouldn't talk through it, should I? Nah, I won't. You will arrive along the old road. It winds with a troubling serpent-like suggestion through the corrupted countryside. Leading only, I fear, to ever more tenebrous places. There is a sickness in the ancient pitted cobbles of the old road. And on its writhing path, you will face viciousness, violence, and perhaps other damnably transcendent terrors. So steal yourself, and remember there can be no bravery without madness. The old road will take you to hell, but in that gaping abyss, we will find our redemption. Oh, God. Just that cutscene put me on edge. Ooh. Uh, map navigation. I'm currently in a room. Yay! To move forth, click on another room on the map display. That little box down below. Uh, that will take me to a connecting hallway. Sounds good. What's in here? Is there anything? Oh, select a destination on the map. Can I not? Oh, I was like, can I not go backwards? But I can. Okay, guys, we're in the game. We got uh, the knight, the crusader, named Reynald. And uh, something that's cool about this game is that each character has a unique personality. So Reynald here is a warrior of light. So when my torch light is above 75, he'll do additional damage. But he'll also steal people's items. And um, the only way he gets stress relief is by praying. I mean, which is which isn't the worst. I can deal with that. Uh, Dismas here. What? I don't know what his mother was thinking, but uh, he has a hard noggin and quick reflexes. But he's also not allowed to gamble when he's in town. Gambling will relieve stress, and stress is a big key um, part to this game, as you get stressed out, your characters will do crazy stuff. Who knows what they'll do. Brigands have run up these lanes. Keep to the side path. The hamlet is just ahead. Awesome. Sounds good. So let's just move forward. Let's uh, get into some combat, hopefully. Well, I, not hopefully. I, this thug in I knew that was, I, I knew that was gonna happen. Your arrival. Okay, combat is turn-based on my hero's turn. I click on a skill icon, then click on a highlight target. It's a frick, it's a, it's a turn-based strategy game. All right, you know what it is. All right, so it's Dismas's turn. What's he gonna do? We're just fighting a, ooh, a brigand cutthroat. What a douchebag. Okay, so what we're gonna do? Let's just use this skill, open vein. It's gonna make him bleed. Let's do it, Dismas. You and me, buddy. You've been training? Oh, man, you've been training for this your whole life. You got it. Just focus. Just, he's just, he's not, they're not even doing anything. They're just standing there looking at each other. Oh, oh boy. Is my light going down? Who knows? Let's get him. Kabang! Did we get him bleeding? Yeah! Suck it, buddy. Oh, no. Now he's going to retaliate. Ha <laughs> You're not fast enough, old chum. And, uh, Reynald here. He's gonna just freaking lay the hammer down. He's gonna smite this son of a gun. Come here. Kaboom. That guy's dead. Falls, oh. Blossoms. See, as you can see there, that little ring above his head was, um, he was getting, like, unstressed. He was getting de-stressed. You know what I'm saying? 
Okay, so we got some gold. Let's take it. Let's keep moving, guys. Come on. Let's hopefully let's hope nothing bad happens. Oh, hello. Okay, so while exploring, I'll often find interactable objects. Click on them or press W to investigate them. Yes. Okay. Well, click clearly where the ambushers camp. And I'm I've done this like five times so far, <laughs> trying to record a decent episode. But I'm not a very good person or YouTuber, I should say. I mean, I'm not a very good person either. You know? What? No, I'm not. I'm not gonna sell myself short. I'm a pretty decent guy. We're gonna check what's in this dude's tent. Oh, hey, look. Leave nothing unchecked. Oh my God! Much to be found in forgotten places. That's worth quite a bit. Oh yeah, but what? <laughs> what I was trying to say before I got a tangent about my uh, being either a good or a bad person, I was um trying to say is that something bad can happen if you interact with objects, or something good can happen. I haven't really delved too deep into that mechanic because I have only played about maybe a half an hour's worth oh boy we got two more guys send these vermin a message oh what a coward Reynold is returned, and they are yeah punish him no he doesn't longer welcome he doesn't change position without me telling him to so um I'm actually too close to use some of my uh, abilities which is indicated by those little yellow and red dots there who I can and cannot hit when I'm in a certain position but I can open a vein or I can just move him back. Let's do that. Let's just switch places with Reynold. We're gonna give him an open. Oh boy. Which? Oh, everything runs red. Oh, oh boy, Mister. Oh, we gonna. What are we gonna do to these guys? Um. Hmm. A zealous accusation might do. We can accuse him. You pooped in the top part of my toilet and not in the bowl oh oh come on you freaking douchebag okay but now he's in his like sort of optimal position and he can hit more people let's use a grape shot cuz that's gonna we're gonna sort of counter this uh, brigand fusilier is that French I don't know I didn't really focus in my French class because my teacher was a douchebag. Anyway, let's shoot these people. <laughs> okay. That did pretty decent damage. That was alright. Oh, okay. Now it's Reynolds' turn. Awesome. So, hmm. We should. We could do a, another zealous accusation. We could try to stun them. Or we could buff them. Should we buff them? Should we Jimmy buff them? Jimmy buff it. You know what? I'm liking the sound of that Jimmy buff me up, baby. Boom. Buff. Go into the buffet, baby. Oh, yeah. You can whip me all day. Actually, that sounds, sounds gross. You can't whip me all day. Take another freaking shit, you son of a gun. Shots all around. He's gonna shoot us again. Oh, my God. I probably should be paying more attention. And, you know, not sucking as bad. You know what? No. I'm doing all right. Let's do a stunning blow. Um, no, should we do something else? Um, it'd be nice if I could. Okay, oh, okay, I do just a base 7 to 13 damage. The stunning blow will do less damage, but it does some. Um, just a. It does stunning damage. Okay, so this does less damage. Okay. Why have I been using Zealous Oh, because it can target more than one person. Okay. Then we'll just smite this dude. Bang! Whoa! Good job, dude. The greater the glory. Crushed by justice! And he's totally... Oh. The, the announcer dude is very pleased with that attack. But as you can see, Reynolds not stressed at all. Oh my god, but he's really low on health. Let's, um... Yeah, these guys are both not doing too well. Let's open a vein on this douche, douchey guy. What? He's got like his nose showing over his little uh, bandana. What a weirdo! Chop his nose off! Boom! He chopped his nose right off. Give them no quarter. Oh, oh, cool! I got a skeleton key, a shovel, um, some jade, and some holy water. Okay, I've never gotten that. Okay, so all the like loot and stuff is obviously randomly generated, but I've never actually gotten supplies 
from uh, completing like a quest, but let's take it all, obviously. We have another object here in front of us, which is a chest. Uh, I mean, look at it. It's a chest, obviously. Oh, but it's a trapped chest. It doesn't look quite right. I'm not... I would just... I'd like to play a prank on Dismas and just have him open it and get trapped. But I'm not gonna, because we need all the health we can get. And he's already ti a tiny bit stressed out. Let's just end our quest by clicking the little ribbons. Dun, 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 dun. Ooh, baby. Ooh, baby, I love you. Wow, those rubies are... Really? Uh, I don't know where I was going with that. I just rolled my R's and totally lost my train of thought. They're valuable is what I meant to say. Okay, next. Woo. Reynold and Dismas both leveled up. Awesome. Let's return to town. Let's go to town. We're going to town on these fools. Kaboomy. Welcome home. Thanks. Such as it is. This squalid hamlet these corrupted lands. Mm -hmm. They are yours now. Oh, and thanks. You are bound to them. Thanks. Oh, is he done talking? Okay. This is our time. I am. What did he say? Oh. Okay. So on any screen of the uh, screen of the game, I can press H to bring up the help menu. Sounds good. Let's do that now. H. Okay. Didn't. I didn't see anything I needed. Oh, why? What am I just Women and clicking? Men, oh. Soldiers and outlaws, fools Ooh. and corpses. Ooh. All will find their way to us now that the road is clear. That sounds very good. Okay, stagecoach um, is where I recruit people, um, for my journey. So, and I can upgrade it. It wants me to upgrade it. Let's exit. Let's let's upgrade it real quick. Come on, we did it. Heroes can be found even here. In the mud and rain. Ugh. I hate the way he... I was going to say I hate the way he describes this place, but it's very vivid and really good. Um, so we got Gaveston here, the um, plague... What is it called? The plague doctor? Okay. He is... Um, I, I love how everyone has their own little quirks. So he's Slayer of Beast. He's Beast Slayer. He gets uh, extra accuracy against um, beasts and a little bit more critical hit chance. He also has a hard noggin. Him and Dismas taking a class in noggin hardening. He has the yips. The yips? I don't even want to know what that is. Okay, and he has a guilty conscience. He bears the crushing guilt of deeds real and imagined? What does that mean? Huh, I don't know. Um... Okay, well, um, yeah, so he, um, he, he'll, he's sort of, I guess, like a mage character, I guess. He's gonna throw, he, he does, he specializes in blight damage. Oh, incision? Okay. They, the, the moves that they start with are all randomized. I've played this game, I've tried, oh, I mean, I've tried to record it like three different times and he's never had incision. Okay, but, um, I think he benefits from being... What better laboratory than mm. the blood-soaked battlefield? No, I think he actually benefits from being at the end. And then we have Mantle here, who is... He's a... She's... Oh, I think it's a she, right? Um, she's a Warren's adventurer, so she doesn't get as stressed when she's in the Warren's. She's a mediator. Um, improves stress reduction while meditating and while camping. Oh, that's cool. But she's a ruminator? Oh, okay. So, um, she won't... Um, recover from stress as easily. All right, she is like a like a paladin practically. Um, she doesn't have as many combat skills as a. She doesn't even have mace bash, which is a bit of a letdown. Um, but that's okay. I'm gonna put her between Dismas, a sister of battle, and, and Reynold, and unrelenting. Yeah, so she's definitely a woman. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I didn't know that at first. Where does Reynold like to be? Obviously in the front, because he's a warrior. Uh, yeah, he's good. G Gaveston, he prefers sort of being in the second position. Or, um, where Dismas is, but he's going to have to deal with where he is. Okay. Alright, let's check out the graveyard, because that's what it wants me to do. Most Ooh. will end up here, covered in the poisoned earth. 
Ugh. Awaiting merciful oblivion. I just realized that we were in the Gringle Mix... McSkickleberries? Why did I name it that? Gringle McSkickleberries Estate. Alright, so I guess the graveyard's where um, your adventurers go when they die. I think it's a bit like, um... Like, a uh, What's that game? Uh, um... Uh, XCOM. Like, um... You, um... Sort of get attached to these freaking characters and then they die and you can visit them in the graveyard. Oh, hey, look, Reynolds itching to go for an adventure, so let's uh, embark. If that's what Reynolds wants, it'll be. Of madness and morbidity. Oh, God. Your work begins. Oh, I, I can never tell when he's done talking. Oh, okay, so this is where we set up our uh, party. We're going to the. The ruins. This is our time! I am prepared! He is like really like itching for battle, but I've noticed that he ha if he has even like a lick of stress, he is like instantly not into the whole ordeal. He is instantly like, oh, please don't send me back to the place. I saw a spider and I don't like them very much. I shall be a soldier against corruption and dismiss. He is the quiet type. He, I don't know why he was traveling with Reynold. They do not seem... Uh, likely companions. Anyway, so yeah, we're headed into the ruins, I guess. Um, I'll, we have to just kill people. What? Choose me for the next expedition. Yes, Reynold. Okay, you're going, buddy. Yes. The cost of preparedness, measured now in gold, later in blood. Oh God. Um. What was I saying? Oh yeah, we're going into the ruins, and basically our only goal is to kill people in every room. But we're going to need some supplies for it, so let's get some food. Now, okay, I know I'm obviously going to be doing some bad, like, some incorrect things. So please don't hate me. <laughs> please like me. I'm going to be doing stupid stuff, like bringing 97 food with me when I should only bring, like, 10. Speaking of which, let's bring ten. I'm gonna bring one. I'm gonna bring only one other shovel because we found a shovel along the way. I'm gonna bring two anti venoms. I'm gonna bring five. I'm not really worried about gold right now because that's it's not really my um, goal. It, uh, my goal is to outfit my warriors with whatever they need to survive. Let's bring some medicinal. I'm gonna bring another anti venom. I'm not going to bring a skeleton key because I don't need it, but I'm going to bring a bunch of torches. Because you end up using a lot of them. We still got 3,500 gold. And f I don't know what else you spend gold on, but maybe I need it more than I think I do. Because I haven't played very much of this. I'm new to it. I'm pl pretty much playing this blind. I only know the basic mechanics. Uh, but yeah, we're ready to go on our journey. Let's do it. We're going into the ruins. The undead will not bleed, but they can be blighted. Oh, the undead do not bleed. The fiends must be driven back. Yes, And they what shall. better place to begin than the seat of our noble line? So as you can see here, oh, this is the map screen, and um, every time you play, the layout of it is chain is um sort of randomized, which is cool. It gives it a added little bit of freshness. But let's move to this room. You just gotta click on what room you wanna go to. This is gonna be a pretty easy shot. It's just a straight hallway, pretty much. Let's move forward to the next room. Oh, good thing I brought some shovels with us. Let's, um... Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. Oh, did I not have another shovel with me? I only brought one shovel? Dear Lord, we're gonna get rinsed. Okay. So uh, we're gonna use our shovel to clear this rubble. I don't know what happens if you um, decide to do it by hand. I've never done it. Oh my god, he, Reynold is just freaking. Now he, minus five accuracy, minus five dodge, and minus one speed. Dear god, Reynold sucks. But whereas Dismiss, it's always been Reynold really sucks and Dismiss always gets better like I don't know that's just my experience I don't like the uh, crusader type people very much um, and everybody else seemed to stay the same which is weird you have the least amount of stress out of all of us who knows who knows let's keep moving on 
Keep on keeping on. What is this thing? Hello? A locked display cabinet. There could be valuables left inside, but this cabinet is locked. Try to open it. What happened to my skeleton key? I I guess we don't have it. Let's try to open it. Boop. Oh. Eh, screw you, <laughs> freaking Reynold. I don't care. <laughs> oh, I should really heal him. Fine. Use it. I don't need him to be poisoned the entire time. Oh boy! Oh god. Okay, so we're fighting some undead. Oh, we dodged it. Good job. Even with his really low um uh, speed. Okay, Dismas is gonna shoot a grape shot. Hopefully, take out this bone rabble. He doesn't have very much health. Let's try it. Kaboom! Ooh, we did some decent damage to that bone rabble guy. Ooh, he crit. That's not good. And it's gonna do stress damage on the whole party. Well, not stress damage per se, but just stress. Oh, staggering force! Oh my! Okay, you're not as important as um some of the other members. So I'm gonna use your turn to switch with Ola. I forgot her name already. <laughs> um, this does extra damage against uh, unholy type creatures, and I think these guys are. No, he's a human apparently. This guy, the bone rabble, is unhealthy. Okay, well he's gonna then he's gonna do a zealous accusation. I'm accusing you of. Okay, so he did some decent damage there. Um, this is going to... It's its like a debuff slash buff. Or like a debuff your... Or, you know what? Screw it. I'm just... I'm not going to say what it's going to do. I'm just going to do it. Kaboom! See, so it debuffed him, and I think it buffed her, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, he just used the bump in the night. The bump is, um, of course, his, um, his little willy. Okay, let's... I'm not going to use his turn to um, move because he's too valuable. I'm going to try to take out this bone rabble. Kaboom! Yay! Good job. Ooh! Dodged it. Good job. What's her name again? I forgot. I Yeah, we'll find out later. Okay, let's try to take out both of these guys with another zealous accusation. Accuse them! Oh, good job, Reynold. Woo! Oh, God. This advantage. Gosh! Give them no quarter. You guys are wussies. Um, hmm. What is she gonna use? She's really, she's just about debuffing the enemy until she gets some actual. Can I not? Okay, whatever. Yep, she, I guess, is just gonna. Hmm. I'm gonna use hand of light on her again. Oh wow, it did do damage to her. Okay. I didn't know that. And he is going to Undead can't bleed. Okay, she's a human though. He he's gonna use incision. Bang! Whoa, good job, Gaveston. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Is that so? Is that so? Okay, so right. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles. Paid for in blood. Everything's paid for in blood nowadays. How do we keep up with this economy? Um. Okay, deed. Uh, Scriven records. It's Scriven. Who the heck knows? Um, but these deeds and uh, crests and like uh, I think they're like represented in these purple boxes. They're all used to upgrade buildings back at uh, at town. Okay, mantle. You're switching back. You're. You're gonna switch. You're gonna switch. Oh my god. You're gonna switch. Alright, now, okay, who wants to open the chest? Who's got the most health? Dismas, you're gonna open the chest. Chest with my family sigil on it? Oh, I could only mean good things. Good. Yay! Oh, okay, so yeah, it's just more uh, fortune smirks, at least. I don't know what he just said. Um, let's just take all this stuff. Good. We got a photo of a ninja here. We got a little um rock. We're looking it's looking up, guys. Let's move to the next room. We're not doing too bad. I've definitely done worse. Okay, let's um let's keep moving. Whew. 
Step by step. Mm -hmm. Um, could be valuables, but this cabinet is locked. Um, hmm. Who do I want to open it? You know what, Dismas? You're going to take another one for the team. Try to open it. Boop, and... Yeah! Good job, Dismas. You're my f friend. <laughs> what am I saying? Oh, well, okay. She said hold up. Uh, nothing? Mantle? What a dumb name. Who names her kid Mantle? Okay, let's keep moving on. Oop. Uh, hello? A rusty Iron Maiden stands again. I'm not even gonna... <laughs> Nothing good sounds like it will come from that. I've never opened one of those, and I don't think I ever will. Unless you guys in the comments tell me, those Iron Maidens will, they, they, they'll give you characters sunny delight. Um, other than that, I don't really want to. The light is fading. The current torch level greatly affects many mechanics in the game. The darker it gets, the harder things get, but the better the rewards. Right click on a torch from my inventory to boost the light back up. Okay. We're fighting freaking guys now. Okay, plus 15 damage. Hmm. Okay, um. It's really. He's. Um, we'll just do emboldening vapors on. Huh. On good old Reynold here. Good job. Smell that, Reynold. Oh boy things that go bump in the night yeah okay divine comfort uh, yeah heal up um Reynold oh it's a full party heal okay that's cool you're gonna do a good old grape chat don't let me down dismiss you haven't let me down so far you let me down I wanted I wanted 19 damage on each of them okay let's take both of these guys out smite let's use um we're gonna light the torch back up haha -ha! see it I, it really makes it like it changes the whole atmosphere when the game or when the torch is uh, dim let's uh, this does extra damage against undead or unholy creatures so I'm gonna smite him boom good job Reynold yeah he's he's not very stressed out um this really does bleed damage so it's not really gonna do anything let's just shoot him bang good job oh no just gonna hit her what a jerk only hitting the woman I guess we'll just do emboldening vapors again on uh, on him dismiss gets a good old uh, good old buff uh, hmm screw it take this bone oh it killed him wow Good job, a Mantle. Trifling victory, but a victory nonetheless. Not a victory nonetheless. Um. So yeah, I was thinking. Uh, I just sort of wanted to involve the community. Not that. Not that I have much of a community. I have 27 subscribers. Actually, no. I have 26 subscribers because one jerk unsubscribed. Even though most of the people that have subscribed to me are my Facebook friends. So it's just one of those friends on Facebook that don't really like you. But they keep you on Facebook anyway because they don't want to know that they that they don't want you to know that they unfriended you. You know what I mean? Um so that guy unsubscribed, which is okay. What was I even saying? Oh yeah. <laughs> I wanted to um let the community or lack thereof decide what these guys would be named. So um I can rename these guys like Gaveston. I'm gonna rename you for now. I'm just gonna rename you Poo Diddly Did Diddly Do. Okay, Poo Diddly Do. Enter. Okay, so if you don't suggest a new name for him, his name is gonna be Poo Diddly Do until the day he dies. And I will forever resent you for not changing his name. So leave a comment. Uh, about a name that you want me to switch up but, but while you're doing that I'll keep moving March friends no it's not March oh crap it is March isn't it <laughs> I was about to say it's not March it's February wait it's not it is actually March I'm an idiot okay let's move to this room this will be the last room for this episode let's keep moving okay 
Let's keep. Let's find some things to kill. I like you so far, Mantle, and you're cool. Um, so we have some books on the ground in an unlikely location. Now I know that these things can, uh, they can change your personality traits, which is cool. I need. Okay, I'm gonna roll the dice here. I'm gonna have Reynald here read some books, gain some knowledge, and hopefully get rid of this crappy, creeping cough. Did you like that alliteration I just did? It was totally unintentional. Anyway, let's get rid of the crappy, creeping cough. Do it! Oh, they're desiccated, unreadable. I, are you sure? Are you sure that Reynald just can't read? Ugh. What's our light at? Let's keep doing it. Oh, I could have scouted. Why didn't I scout? Okay, let's keep moving. Keep... Oh, no! The t the t they put out my torch slightly. Let's bring that back up. Um, hmm. Let's do another grape shot because it's going to target all three of these guys. Oh, wow. I've never seen the Arbalist before. He is frightening looking because he has quite a bit of armor. But um, I'm going to take... I'm gonna just do a great shot. Bang! Wow. Okay, it did pretty good damage to this bone soldier. Um, hmm. Plague grenade. I'm gonna try to take out. Yeah, these two guys. That looks good. And it blighted them. No, they resisted it. Dang. Okay, he's gonna. He's gonna splash some of his grog in old Dismas's face here and make him a little stressed out. He does. N wow. That's. That's not good. That did more damage than I would have liked. Um, fine. Zealous accusation. Let's accuse these guys of not filing their taxes on time. Whoa! They'll call that an audit. Let's heal up. Let's heal up um, all of us. Awesome. Good job, Mantle. You're doing a really good job. Okay, grape shot. Let's take both of these guys out. Dismiss, you haven't failed me yet. Boom! That was some good damage. Good damage going. Ooh, stabbed her right in the kisser. Um, she is just gonna keep healing, honestly. Maybe that's a bad move. Maybe it's not, though. So that's what I'm banking on, the fact that it isn't a bad move. Ooh, okay. Crossbow with, <laughs> with a bayonet on it. That's a double trouble. Okay, but he is gonna just smite the nuts right off of this bone arbalist. Kaboom! No. Come, come on, dude. Okay, maybe, um... Oh! A disorienting blast could be actually really useful because once he's in the first position, all he can do is do his little swipe move. I'm gonna... That's what I'm guessing, by the way. Uh, I'm just assuming. Kaboom! Disorient! Yeah, now he's in front, and all I can do is slash, which is probably a le less effective move. Um, I'm gonna have him... Uh... This does 50% less damage. This is 25%. I'm going to do a pistol shot. No, I can't do that because then I won't. You know what? No, Reynolds got a score to settle with his Arbalist here. Um, Dismiss is going to do a nice pistol shot on the courtier. Boom, baby. We did it. Good job. Oh. Reeling. And I say he can't do very much damage, but... You know, it's only six damage. He did about the same with a normal, um... With a normal shot from his bow. So I'm... It was actually a good move on my part, I'm gonna say. I'm just gonna brag about myself real quick. Um... Reynald, let's take a sniff of this and then smite the nuts off of this guy! Good job! Good job, guys. We're doing really good! This expedition at least promises success. Yeah, it does. This is the easiest it has been for me in this game. Uh, not a whole lot of bad stuff has happened. What's next? Yes, okay, we're about halfway through this dungeon, which will be nice. Let's, um, let's... Oh, let's just finish out this room. Let's get to the room. I have seen so very much light guide me. Oh, he... just happened what did you do what did that do poo diddly do what did you do what did you poo diddly do okay <sighs> well let's um I can't camp because uh, um 
I don't have firewood, which is apparently what you need to camp. I would have liked to. That's a I love that mechanic. I expected there to be a fight. Oh no, don't get mismatched now. Um Actually, you know what? She might be she might benefit from being back there because all she's gonna do is heal for right now. That might be a really bad idea. But um You know what? We're gonna do it. Let's do a plague grenade on um, these two guys. Bang! Did they get it? Yeah, he's blighted in the back there. Ooh, and he took some a bit of blight damage. He splashed a bit of grog and Dismas's face, and he really did not like the smell of it. Oh, she didn't like it very much either. Oh god, they're very stressed out. Um, hmm. Oh, he can target three people with this thing, so that'll be good. He also has a buff that um, raises his accuracy and his critical strike, but um, I have a feeling I didn't want to waste a move because he is uh, like our main DPS right now. Ooh. Ooh. Ouch. So, uh, I'll leave the uh, buffing up to, um, to, um, Mantle and, and, uh, freaking Gavestin. Oh, I didn't even mean to do that. <laughs> but it was probably not the worst idea. Let's use a Zealous Accusation. Um, even though it does less damage, it can target both of these guys. And they're both on relatively low health. If I can get some good damage on them, they might both go down right now. Bang! Okay, that was good. That was decent. Now I'll get a grape shot in with, um, Dismas. And, um, it should... This cannot continue. Yes, it can. Just shoot a gun at the guy. Stop splashing freaking liquids in my face. Man, Mantle's at actually uh, surprisingly low health. Okay, yes. Okay, this is exactly what I wanted. Uh, it's a ranged attack, and it can target all of them. Let's get this guy on the ground. Put him on the ground, Mantle, and it will heal her for three, which is good. Bang! You did really good, Mantle. I liked that. Now, Grape Shot, finish off all three. Oh, ho, ho, they all have three. He's going in for a multi-kill. Multi-kill! Boom! And now it's just this one little guy. He's just got his little dagger. He can't do nothing. Smite him down, Reynold. Kabang! Good job, Reynold. I love you. Remind I used yourself to... that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. He always does that. When I'm like starting to get overconfident, he always says that. <laughs> He's always like, don't get too confident or soon you're gonna really suck. Okay. I want to, um, I would like to scout. Can I do that? I think I just have to... Can I... Can I scout, please? I don't know how it works. I've just like randomly scouted like I'd wait in a room and it would just scout ahead automatically can it not do that dismiss dismiss do I have to click on dismiss I wonder is there ability to scout ahead precision striker I don't know okay guys well that I think about sums it up for this time if you know how I get scouting to work I'd really appreciate that in the comments uh, another thing I'd appreciate in the comments is um, a, a name suggestion for the, some of these guys. Like Mantle, I could rename her or something. I could rename her to, you know, whatever you guys want. Uh, or else uh, he's going to be forever known as Poo Diddly Do. And I'm legitimately not okay with that. Um, but yeah, if you have any suggestions or anything, I'm not the greatest at this game. I'm not pretending that I am. Uh, but if you have any suggestions for, you know, like, ways I should be playing, go ahead and leave them in the comments. I'll take them. Um, but anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, if you liked it, hit the like button. And if you didn't like it, get the heck out of my video. No, I'm just kidding. If you didn't like it, hit the like button. <laughs> and, uh, if you want to see more, please hit subscribe, because I'm hoping to make this, um, a regular series. It looks, it's a, it's a pretty fun game from what I've played. But thank you guys. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.